pretty cool idea. I would have did it for free, but the girl to give the hundred dollars, it's a bonus. That's the reward for gun owners turning in unwanted weapons at the Guns for Gift Cards exchange at the Kirkland Police Department. They're old long guns that were in a closet that uh, the laws change, you gotta have them locked up. I don't own a gun safe, so I don't want the liability and they're safer here than in my house. Officials with KPD say Saturday's event is the third Guns for Gift Cards exchange this year, with two previous events held over the summer, where Kirkland residents dropped off more than 150 unwanted guns. There's the possibility that a home, a family home, could be burglarized. Uh, these guns could fall into the hands of, a, of the wrong individuals, criminals, if you will, that, that now are going to take these guns and use them for the wrong reasons. Cody Mann with KPD says the gift cards range from 25 to $250, depending on the type of gun exchanged. Man says KPD will review each gun's serial number, and unless it's found to be involved in a crime, it will be destroyed. And we have no issues with responsible gun owners that want to maintain their firearms either for hobbies, for hunting, or for uh, self-defense in any way. Uh, but these are this situation is more about the people that are uncomfortable with these guns or just have no use for them anymore in their house. Saturday's event ended with 46 guns collected, which man considers a huge success. If even if it's just one gun that's taken off the streets that would have been used for the wrong reasons in the wrong hands, it's worth it. KPD officials say they also plan to do an in-person gun safety class before the end of the year. In Kirkland, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News.